Hi, it's Investivas Kiana with News BTC, and here's your cryptocurrency update. Today, we're looking at a lesser known altcoin called Walton Chain as per the request of one of our Investiva members, Mike. Walton Chain, or how it's known to the crypto crowd, WTC, is a China based company that claims to have created a value Internet of Things ecosystem combining the blockchain technology with something called RFID. Value Internet of Things, or VIOT, creates a business ecosystem integrating the real world with blockchain. Walton is both an acronym for Wisdom Alters Label Trade Organization and Network, and the name of the man who came up with the idea of patenting the RFID in 1983. RFID stands for a radio frequency identification and it refers to the idea of having a simple process that would enable a true merging of a digital value with a real life physical object. It provides a unique identifier for things like mobile and credit card payments. Walton Chain claims to create a more efficient market, a business ecosystem that would allow clothing industries and products with RFID technology within the Internet of Things to establish a solid environment. With that, members can have access to fast and cheap transactions by establishing a connection between nodes, chains, products, and the Internet of Things. These will all be supported and operated by Walton Chain. Now, of course, our only source to research about Walton Chain at this point is to read through their proposals and decide whether they are genuine about their claims and ambitions. However, they have been able to sign partnerships with companies such as China Telecom's Zhang Zhu branch, as well as the US US-based company Loki, uh, which has created a platform for IP research. At the time of filming, Walton Chain ranks 40 in terms of coin market cap and has been down 7% for the day. After falling from the all-time high levels above $42 back in January, it has been having a hard time breaking above the resistance level of $27.34. Thanks for watching, Mrs. Responsibly, and I'll see you with more updates tomorrow.